Hello everyone, Rich here, back for another Minecraft ship video, and this is the RMS Campania, uh, an ocean liner from an 1892. Uh, one of two ships in the fleet as well, the other one I think was called the Lucenia or Lucenia, I can't remember what it was called, uh, but there were two of them anyway. Uh, this is the uh, sort of the longer lasting of the two. Uh, this one sailed up until the First World War, where she was commandeered and converted into an aircraft, can uh, aircraft carrier. Basically, they chopped the first funnel off, replaced it with two smaller funnels, and yeah, it became a basic aircraft carrier, but uh, not in this version anyway. Uh, so yeah, it's a fairly obscure ship design. Um, but yeah, it's not one of my best designs, I will admit, because there is not <coughs> not a lot of information about this ship available in terms of deck plans or photographs. Most of the stuff I had to uh, research on models or. Um, models from other games basically so I just had to sort of go with what I had so yeah it's not not the uh, prettiest of ships but uh, you know it's not too bad nonetheless and uh, it's basically a shorter version of the oceanic the hull is exactly the same well I'll say exactly the same it's about uh, well it's shorter anyway than the oceanic the oceanic was the last tutorial I'd done um, and this has basically borrowed the hull from it but it's shorter in length uh, and slightly shorter in height as well but uh, overall it's basically the same hull. Uh, we've modified a few bits, uh, cut a few holes in the side and things like that, but anyway that is the basics of the uh, Campania. So we'll just fly over the top, over the folks and go down towards the rear. Ignore the ship in the in the background there, that is just a dud which was going to be the Storstad but I gave up with it. Uh, anyways, actually if I go this side you can ignore it much better. So I'll fly over this way. And there we go, so we fly over the forecastle there, and then along the top of the superstructure here, got the ship's wheelhouse on top there. And uh, it's all fairly basic structure, there's not a lot of detail I could uh, research on this thing. Like I say, it's sort of having to research models and things like that, but you know, I sort of used what I had, and uh, this is what I've come up with. And I don't think it looks too bad because that's my opinion. I mean, there are a lot of people out there who know a lot more about these things than. Uh, yeah, it's not, uh, not the best, but it's the best I can come up with. And uh, yeah, I spent a few weeks on, on and off of this thing. I was, it sort of started just before Christmas. And um, yeah, it's sort of got to this point now. Uh, it's sort of in production when I did the, did the uh, year in review video um, back, I think that was Christmas Eve, uh, when I did that video. And it's sort of half in production then, so I just sort of gone on and on, uh, on and off building it throughout uh, January and uh, it's not too bad in my opinion anyway so ignore the little yellow stripe on the bow as well that's just something I added but uh, overall I don't think it's too bad it's a very weird looking ship in terms of what we have now I mean we have loads of ocean liners here Titanic Majestic and all things like that it's a very different concept to those things of course it's an early ocean liner as well I mean look if you look at the bridge and the bridge wings themselves they are suspended on pillars rather than attached to the uh, proper superstructure so it is uh, an obscure looking thing, but hey ho, there we go. And also, I've got an open area on the hull down here. And uh, don't look too bad. It's just basic promenade, really. There's nothing really to look at. You can see it's just a corridor, basically. So that's that. And uh, yeah, don't look too bad. But uh, as per usual, if you want a tutorial for this thing, then just let me know. I have not confirmed or denied that I'll do a tutorial for it. I just thought I'd let people decide themselves. Um. Because I'm sort of, well, I'm not running out of ideas, but I don't really want to go on and just build the Costa Concordia and the Titanic 2, which is what everyone wants me to do. I do not want to do those two ships. Because Titanic 2 is just a crap idea, and the Costa Concordia is only famous because it rolled over onto its side, so I'm not, I'm not going to bother with those two. And I'm just going to stick to more modest projects. And, uh,. Yeah, I think, uh, I think what I've done here I've pulled off quite well. Uh, apart from the ship next door, which is was going to be the Storstad, or I can't remember the pronunciation, but it's the one that collided with the Empress of Ireland. This was going to be it, but this is just a dud and will be removed after this video. Uh, a ship over there, you can see, that is the Californian. I've pretty much built or redesigned that thing. So that is pretty much finished over there, the Californian. Um, apart from the colour scheme, which is still in debate, but... I'll worry about that one another day. I'll do another video for it later on as well. Because it's, it's more or less finished. But it just needs a bit of a tidy up. So that's the Californian over there. And uh, it's one of the uh, many ship tutorials that's going through the March Cull. So I'm going to be removing a lot of videos soon. 
uh, in March, which will consist of Californian, Carpathia, um, Aramis Midia, and a few others, Ivernia and all those sorts of things. All the ships that were crap in their time and are still crap today, so they're all going to be removed. And some are being remade. I mean, I've, like I said, I've done the Californian. And uh, some more will follow after that, but we'll wait and see. Uh, but anyway, that is uh, the RMS Campania. It depends how you want to pronounce it. It could be Campa Campania, Campania. It's up to you how you want to interpret it. I've just gone for what the pronunciation is online, so there we go. And what other people pronounce it as. So Campania is what I'm going with. And uh, that's what I uh, intend to keep it as. But, uh, yeah, if you're interested in a tutorial on how to build this thing, then just let me know. There's, uh, it won't be this week. It'll probably start either next week or the week after, depending on what time I have. Uh, in that time, I can tidy up the loose edges on this thing, the rough edges, and uh, just smart up a bit more. I mean, there's always room for improvement, so we shall see at that. But anyway, that is the Aramis Campania, or Campania, or however you want to pronounce it. And we'll leave it at that, so... Yeah, if you want a tutorial, let me know, and uh, we shall move on to that. So anyway, this is Rich signing off, logging off, disappearing, and I shall return with another video soon. So um, yeah, bye for now.